No more trials for the Baltimore police officers charged in the death of Freddie Gray. The cases have been dismissed. You've seen the civil unrest occur in Baltimore in the wake of the Freddie Gray incidents. I know you've had to send some reinforcements to Baltimore in the past to help with that. And now with another acquittal of a police officer there, do you think that justice is being done with respect to the Freddie Gray case? Well, I think that we were very concerned, obviously. Um, we watched uh, the, the situation in Baltimore simmer and simmer and simmer. Um, one thing I know for sure is that people want transparency, they want answers, and they want justice and they want justice to be served. And that's what we focus on in Washington, D.C. How do we continue to invest in good police and community relationships? But one way to ensure that is to be transparent um, and place accountability where it lies. And that's what we will continue to do. Were you surprised by this series of acquittals in this case? I have to tell you, um, I have been surprised by a lot um, with the Freddie Gray case, but I think that there's going to be a lot for the justice system to learn um, as it relates uh, to that case. What can we do to reform the justice system in ways that respect people's sense of justice? Well, we have to demand accountability, uh, and that's for sure. One thing that I've focused on in, in D.C. is making sure one of uh, one vestige of our relationship with the federal government is that we don't have elected states prosecutors. So our prosecutor is the United States Department of Justice, and they are removed from the citizens. They are not accountable to the voters of Washington, D.C. Um, so one thing about justice is it has to be swift. Um, and sometimes our prosecutors and that part of the justice system is very slow, and especially when it comes to police involved incidents, whether it's shooting or in custody death. Uh, we have to be thorough, um, that's for sure, but we have to be thorough um, and quick.